to get Grab that cash with both hands and make a stash And we are counting money We are, count we are counting the money at Los Alamos National Laboratory on, on public property and we are set up in front of these um, the Los Al beautiful Los Alamos sculpture um, and you can see that it says on the on the sculpture it says Los Alamos where discoveries are made so the, the count what we're doing here is we're um, operating as a satellite counters and in solidarity with an international action that's happening all this week in New York City during the United Nations General Assembly and Disarmament Week. And there's an organization called Move the Nuclear Weapons Money that has been organized for some years now that is working towards divestment, global divestment from nuclear weapons industries divestment from banks that support them, pressuring the levers of power to make laws that support sustainable development goals, mitigate climate change, and take m the money from the nuclear weapons industry and the war economy and using that money that's being wasted it, in the trillions of dollars and using it for things for the good of all people. So today we are trying to count 13 billion dollars and let me show you, hang on one sec. Oh, okay. So we have the the action for, for Move the Nuclear Weapons Money is called Count the Nuclear Weapons Money. And the action is to show the enormity of, to viscerally show and physically show the, the insane enormity of this amount of millions of dollars. This is probably $20 million right here. I mean, can you even imagine? And what Sandy, Sandy's like sort of the champion counter, but he has right now. Hang on one sec. I've counted $820 million so far. And so this is just a fraction. When, when you look in this box, 820 million so far today. And you can, you can, 840, he's counting, and, and Janet is counting. She just started. Kay, Kay is counting. Kay has a mere $300 million. And Joni has only 600. And we're not even close because we're trying to get to 13 billion today. And so when you look in a, the box, can you hold these for a sec, John? Yeah. So then he, this is another good, it, and when you're actually counting this, it, it makes you really, it affects you and it affects, affects people to see this. So you can look in that box. Don't know. This box we know has 2.4 because Joni and other friends counted this money in Socorro on Saturday. I don't know if I can lift it for you to see it. So it's very, very full. And then, so the Move the Money campaign sent us all this money. They sent us in New Mexico 14,000 one million dollar bills. So this box is full. Now I've got 400 million. Woo so we have a billion right here on our table. Say that again. We have a 
say that again. Now I have 400 million. Now we've got a billion on our table. And this box is full too, Bob. And this box is getting there, but it still has that much. It's um There's 900 million right there, Bob. Approaching approaching a billion here. I'm on the final stretch to a billion dollars. Okay, and I um so the 13 billion dollars is signifies the amount of money that Los Alamos National Laboratory and the Department of Energy wants to spend to modernize, do their component of modernizing the entire United States nuclear weapons arsenal. And at Los Alamos, the, the main, they call it their mission, is a national security mission, things like that means making plutonium pits, which are the, the triggers or the, the, the fissile cores that are needed in order to detonate a nuclear warhead. And so that's part of the, the massive, um, did I say 13 billion? I, I, I might have said something incorrect. I, I meant, if I said 13 trillion, I meant to say 13 billion dollars over the next 10 years for Lanol to make plutonium pits and, and all the infrastructure necessary. Okay, is this better? Oh, okay. <laughs> so, the in the United States, the plan, the plan is, which was started during the Obama administration, was to modernize the entire nuclear weapons, modernize is the euphemistic word, to remake the entire United States nuclear weapons arsenal to the tune of, it's, I believe it's up to $1.7 trillion over the next 10 to 20 years. And I, I, I can't say those figures for sure, but it's a lot of money. So this movement is, as I said before, is to demonstrate for people to become more aware, hopefully, of, of the enormity of this money that's being wasted. And, and again, this is a global action, not just the United States. So there have been counting events in New York every day this week. Today at the big banks, is their main counting day. So they are in New York City. The counters are counting in front of some of the big banks that, that fund, uh, invest in nuclear weapons industries. And they're calling it their main counting. And so we are doing this today at Los Alamos with this huge amount of money in solidarity with the main event in New York City. I'm looking at a billion dollars of silly money. <laughs> it, it smells silly, it looks silly, and in a way it really is silly, at least this side of the bill, what it's going towards, when it could be going towards this side of the bill, changing the world. Well, that, that Crazy. For the, um, for Crazy. Just craziness. So, on the back of the bill, uh, it reads, let's spend the mo this money on a sustainable world for all of our kids. Clean oceans, clean air, and that's all that's in print. And there's a, then there's a picture of a globe and the children of the world. And is that the oceans? Yes, it's the oceans. And show the bill, turn the bill so that to the camera for Bob. 
think I did, but here we go. Here, wait. You take the rubber. It reads another one million dollars for nuclear weapons. WTF. Say no to the military industrial complex. So that's the symbolism of what we're doing here today, which is to try to transform what's happening into what could be happening. Thank you. So here is the discovery that was made at Los Alamos National Laboratory. I don't know what else to say. It's just. And the guys that made this discovery and then saw what happened with it were mortified by this and regretted it for the rest of their lives. <laughs>